Hi, this is Chris Schroeder. Welcome back to the ACCO Legislative Update. This week, the legislature turned their attention to floor work and hearing bills that have previously passed committee. There were well over a hundred bills heard in each chamber this week, with several county-related bills receiving a floor hearing. Let's start by discussing House Bill 3273 by Representative Bowles. This bill alters the formula for county officer salaries by increasing the base salary by $5,000. The bill passed the House floor 93 to 0. Another bill by Representative Bowles also passed the House floor Tuesday. House Bill 3271 is a modernization bill that opens county bidding up to the online process with electronic bids. The bill passed 95 to 0. House Bill 3913 by Representative Wallace that appropriates $20 million to the CERB fund passed the House this week also with a vote of 95 to 0. Senator Stanislaski passed Senate Bill 1613 off the Senate floor 44 to 1 and it allows counties to lease or lease purchase machinery and equipment from the state contract. And lastly, Senator Hall passed Senate Bill 1403 this week that requires a state auditor to audit circuit engineering districts. Keep in mind that once a bill passes out of one chamber, it then moves to the opposite chamber to go through the same process of being heard in committee and then to the floor for a hearing. Please remember that next Wednesday, the 11th, is our annual legislative breakfast with CODA and it's Trust Transportation Day at the Capitol. Invite your legislator to attend. That's all I have. Thanks for watching the ACCO Legislative Update.